My reaction to Thursday in F1 Bahrain 2034. First, we're going to talk about free practice. One, hey, but I was weirdly actually at school and still had time to watch it. So that was the perfect time. But this one, the session was taught by Daniel Ricardo. These sessions, these times were more unrepresentative. Because, you know, include a few, a few glory runs. Because most of these laps were on the medium tire. So Daniel, Lando, Oscar, and Sonoda, and Fernando, I believe, were on the soft tire. Yeah, RB looking good. McLaren looking good, I guess. Yeah, um, nothing more really to say from first practice. Other than Alpine not looking too good, Haas, you know, of course, they're probably going to be last. But yeah, Ricardo will be in that session. It was, it's nice to see, but not really representative of their true pace, I believe. That was kind of just a late glory run, I would say. Okay, now the real talking point is free practice too, because that first time is representative. Alright, second practice. Well, first of all, Red Bull is either sandbagging. What happened six, Paris 10th? Yeah. That's thing. I don't know what happened to Lando because I wasn't able to watch all of FP2. I don't know what happened to Lando. Like, he's 20th? Like, what's going on there? Once again, Alpine look horrendous. Honestly, they don't look very good. Like, Alpine, yeah, those rumors that are probably one of the slowest cars on the grid is probably true. But yeah, that's most of the top, and now we have a Mercedes 1-2. Honestly, Mercedes looked really good. This, this test, they look like at least second or third quickest. Trust me, a lot better than they looked in testing. Uh, in testing, we all, like, some people even thought, predicted that they were, like, sixth quickest. But they actually look alright. We got Alonzo up there, Sainz, Piastri, Verstappen, six. I don't know what happened there, I guess we were just focusing on other stuff. We got Williams in, in 11th and 13th looking pretty steady, honestly. We got Hulkenberg in 7th, I completely forgot to talk about that. Hulkenberg, looks like half of might be in the other quality car, but we don't know. And yeah, um, Kit Sauber, you know, doing Kit Sauber things, and Alpine doing Alpine stuff. It seems like Alpine looks like at least the 8th worst team. So it looks, it's back in our right now, looks to be... Red Bull, Ferrari, Mercedes, McLaren, Aston. Well, make sure between Aston and RB. Then seven flights we have Williams, then Alpine, then um, Stake, and then um, Haas. That's all the pecking order looks right now to me. But yeah, that's wrapping up for this. So uh, tomorrow is qualifying. Sadly, sadly. I'll be at school, and that's happening at a time that I won't be able to like watch it. So that reaction, so that reaction, I it's gonna suck because I won't be able to see it long. So I'm just gonna, gonna come home and see it. Well, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Oh yeah, tomorrow is the channel update, by the way, because that's tomorrow is the first of March. Not gonna lie, I kind of forgot. But yeah. Oh, yeah, later.